Hey Ann, what's all these pins for? They're mark in the middle so I know to switch directions of the design. Mark in the middle so you know to switch directions. What you're about to do right here. That's a good idea. Good tip for people. I don't like marking on clothes because it doesn't always come off. Yeah, that's true. Especially if you're dealing with old fabrics. The stuff that's been starched, sometimes you have problems with the fabrics. Yeah. They'll bleed if you use a white marker or a, or a disappearing ink pen and then you get it wet. Yeah. Are you going to use the pin trick here, too? Yep. That's what this ruler's for. It's got measurements on it. Ah. Omni grip. Yeah, it's just a normal, this is just your normal ruler, cutting ruler. Right. Um, Not for long arming. No, this is a long arming ruler. See how much thicker it is? Yeah. Than the other one. Because if you use this, you're going to break needles, put your foot, uh, machine out of time. You, it's all kinds of problems. So don't do that. Use, use these and get the right one for your machine. There's quarter inch height and there's three quarters inch height. And sometimes even bend a needle bar. We've never done that with any of ours, but no. I'm sure it's happened to somebody. Oh yeah, you can cause yourself all kinds of problems. So use <laughs> use a normal ruler, but for marking with pins or marking with the the ink disappearing ink pins or the blue line, those kinds of things, which I don't like to do. And for this, all I need is a little. It's about here, mark. Where the pink line is, pink. Where that is not well. Some of mine are actually 12 inch square, but not all the handkerchiefs. This one was a 10 inch square. Oh, okay. Hey, somebody should make a ruler like this, but thicker. That would be nice. There's probably one out there, but I haven't really looked. Yo, if you all know someone that has that, let us know. Then you could use this as a ruler and as um, a marking. Yeah. Device. Yeah, I mean, some of them are nice. Like this one does have some lines. I don't know. If, yeah, you can see it. Little. On my hands. This is the girl. little girl the get from the Gadget Girls. Okay. And it's got some lines, but it would be really nice actually to have inch markings because then you could find them easy. There's a million dollar idea for somebody. Hey, we should do that. <laughs> well, we'd have to do some research because there might be one already. Oh, okay. I just don't have it. Right. But she wants one. If you got one, let us know. Okay, so now you're coming up on the pin. And you're going to change direction. Ah, oh, I see you did. Pretty cool. Now you can go all the way around and do that same thing, just like you did over on here. See where it changes directions? Very, very neat, Anne. 